What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Volpro Scooters. My name is Austin and today we are here for another custom build. But we're not doing your traditional custom build. We actually flew in a very special guest that I'm very excited to introduce. Hello guys, my name is Ben. You might know me as like Big Air Ben on my Instagram, but today we are gonna do a custom build. Dude, that was first try. This kid's a natural. If you guys don't know Big Air Ben, you should check him out on Instagram. <laughs> How old are you, Ben? I'm eight. He's eight years old. He's smarter than me and honestly a better scooter rider than me. <laughs> and at the time that this video will be released, Ben will be announced as the last of the three new team riders for the vault. So. Welcome aboard, Ben. Thank you. He's eight and he rides for the vault, so let's get it. You excited to do a? I am so excited. On a scale of one to ten, how excited are you to do a custom build? Ten out of ten. You told me that you've been like a big fan of the channel. You've watched a lot yeah. of customs. What yes. was your favorite custom? Probably Matisse's like Red Bull custom build. Because I, if you don't know, I drink Monster. Don't tell them that. That's how old are you again? 18. Eight. He's 18. Yeah, I'm 18. Yeah. All right. Well, we're not going to do a normal custom build. I heard from some sources that you're a big uh, superhero fan, right? Yes. And I heard specifically you really like Thor. Yes. How did you know that? <laughs> hey, man. Like I said, I got the sources. So, I even heard that you're growing out your hair because you like Thor so much. Yes. Is that really true? Yes. I also heard that you have a Thor lunchbox. Or you did have a Thor lunchbox. Yeah, I did, but I don't know what happened to it. That was so cute. Well, Ben, I say we do a Thor-themed custom build. I'm down. Dude, you don't sound excited. Are you down? I, I am so down. To do a Thor-themed custom build? Yes! You think we could do it? Yes. All right, well here, let's throw up an image on the screen of Thor so they can get an idea of what we're gonna do. I did a little bit of research. It's a lot of red, some grays, and a little bit of gold. But honestly, I think we could do it. Really? Mm-hmm. You think okay. we got it? Yeah, I think we can. Well, let's go into the warehouse, Ben. Let's pick out our parts. <laughs> oh! Ah! Uh, all right. Yo, this guy is good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Ben. I have a photo of Thor here. Uh -huh. That's the Thor you're a big fan of? Yes. Why the pause? Is well, I mean, that is, it's not my favorite, but it's my second favorite. What's your sec, what's your number one favorite? Uh, well, I don't know <laughs> this one. There's so many Thors, I just love them. All right, well this is the Thor yes. we're gonna use okay. as a, uh, a base for our scooter. This is what we're gonna be basing the build around, all right? Hey, Chris Hemsworth. Come do a custom build. All right, Ben. So, like I said, we see a lot of like gun metals and chromes. There's some red, some is yellow. Is filming? Yeah. Oh, wow. This is the part picking process. We oh, I, get our... I didn't even know. Well, the cool thing is, is I see you riding a pandemonium deck, right? Yes. I say we use a pandemonium deck for this build as well. Yeah. I think the trans black pandemonium will actually be super similar. What do you think? Yeah. All right. Where is it? Do you see trans black anywhere? I only see matte black. Where is trans black? Oh, I'm gonna fall, oh, Ben. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, I found it. All right. We got it! Let's see, you wanna open it up? It's like, it's like Christmas, dude. I know you wanna open the deck yeah. up. Yeah. Come on, just open up. Boom. All right, so you're telling me, that looks pretty close to that, right? Uh, yeah, of course. Come on, you guys seeing this? That's pretty similar to the color of his uh, his armor here, if I have to say so myself, right? Yeah. I think that's a perfect fit. You wanna do grips? Sure. Well, if we're gonna do grips, the grips at the top of the scooter. So you think we should do grips to try to match? His blonde hair. You think we should do grips to match his hair? Yeah. All right, let's go look at grips. There's so many grips. Right. Let's see. So we need to go with a color like his hair, and it's blonde. Huh. Oh, that'll do. I think. Honestly, Ben, those ones are uh, pretty perfect. Look at that. It matches perfectly. That's fire. That is literally fire. Yeah, I know. Okay, so now we got grips and we got a deck. So, I have a Should cool we do idea. Bars? Watch, Ben, come here. What? Look at this. So on his armor, he has these like plates, right? Yeah. They're kind of like buttons. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're kind of like that faded gold colorway. 
Are you ready for this? Yes. Oh my gosh. Is Bruh. that not is that not perfect? That is perfect. What can I say? I'm a god. Tell him how perfect it is. It is like just Oh my god. It's perfect, right? I'm speechless. This is so good. Okay, so I think that deck is perfect. Those grips are perfect. They yes. even match the wheels. Yes. We need two of them. So here's the other one. Oh. I think we need more gunmetal or black parts for the best or for the rest of the scooter. So we need what to get. What should a... we do for grip tape? I don't know. That, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Okay. But I was thinking about it, and the deck is trans black. Okay. Yes. There's not really a lot of trans black parts out there, but Ethic does make. Oh my. Gosh. Black chrome. This is pretty similar to trans black, right? Uh, yeah. And like really, that's like all, literally. And it matches perfectly. That is like, like it's like, it is just. That's the color. That's that's what I'm saying. So you want to do it? Yeah. You think it's the move? Totally. All right. And I think there's even a matching clamp, Ben. We gotta find a black chrome ethic clamp. Bro, where is it? Oh, I think I found it. All right, open that up. I'll trade you. Give me the okay. grips. Oh, oh, oh no. My boss is gonna fire me. Will you tell him that it was your fault? Please, this is my job. Okay. Hey, you got a real one, pound it. Thanks, G. All right, I'll take the wheels too. Open up that clamp, show them what we're working with. Hmm. What? Uh. Are you speechless or what? Yeah! Show them what it looks like. With the fork? This is gonna look epic. Beautiful. So let's go set all this stuff down with the deck. Boom. This is a great start, Ben. I was also curious, why is Thor your favorite superhero? What do you like so much about him? I just like that he's just, he has so much lightning and it looks so cool. And it's just, he's just, he's just really cool. Hey man, I back that. My favorite superhero is Spider-Man. Oh, mm -hmm. that's my second favorite. It was a really good picture of me when I was your age. And I'm like shooting out web. Well, I think it's web. There's not really a web. I'll find the picture. We'll put it on the screen. Okay. It's really cool. And here I am 20 years later building a scooter with you. Yeah. We're killing it. All right. So we need to get some red, Ben, because red. obviously Thor has a red cape. Am I right? Yeah. So I'm thinking we do a red bar. How do you feel? Totally. You think that's the move? Yeah. What kind of bars do you like? Well, obviously red titanium, yeah, but... Yeah, I like titanium bars. Well, there's no red titanium bars, so we're kind of out of luck there, but... Is there aluminum? There is, but not... It won't work with the compression. Oh, so, what's the man. last option? Steel. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. All right, so, steel bars. There's a lot of options. Yes. So you know who makes a really good red? What? Affinity makes a really good red. You know who Affinity is? No. It's okay. They're the kings of T-bars. They make the best colors. They make every color you could imagine, including red. Oh, hmm? yes. Crazy, let's go take a peek. Look at all the beautiful colors these bars come in. But we need the red ones right there. So how well versed are you in scooter knowledge, Ben? Do you know a lot about scooters and how they work? Uh, I'd say I'm like, like from a scale of one to 10, I'd say I'm probably like a six. Okay, let me see. Okay, then tell me this. Ugh. Are these bars oversized or standard? I want to say standard. Mm-mm, oversized. Oversized? Do you know what compression we're going to ride with these bars? SES. We're not going to ride SES. You know what the other one is? HIC. Yes, sir. Dude, he knows more about scooter parts than like Because I'm riding SES here. right here. He is riding SES. That is a fair point. But yeah, we're going to be riding HIC with these, but look at how good that red is. Oh my goodness. Do you think that's Thor cape acceptable? <laughs> yeah. You think so? I think it's gonna look perfect. So we'll have to cut him down a little bit to make it fit the scooter a little bit better, but yeah. I think that gets the job done perfectly. That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's get the rest of our parts. <sighs> yeah, all right, gotta get some grip tape. I think this is where we can add some really cool stuff, Ben. What should we do? Well, there's a lot of options, but where does Thor kind of revolve around? You know, he's always going back and forth in the Bifrost from Earth to Asgard. Yeah. So he's kind of always in the galaxy, right? He's in outer space. Oh, yeah. Like in, you know, the first, yeah. or I don't even remember. But 
He's always in the galaxy, so what if we do galaxy grip tape? Show Heck the, yeah! Show the camera your reaction, come on. <laughs> this is gonna be amazing. Do you think it fits with the Thor theme? Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Well, we need a headset, and honestly, Ben, what? I think a black headset is honestly gonna get the job done. Okay. So, we're gonna go with our brand new Vault Velocity 2 headset. <laughs> That's gonna mm -hmm. be nice. Mm -hmm. that's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. This is a black headset, nothing too crazy. But Gotta represent. Get the hey, man's rides for the vault. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so we have our grips. We yes. have a bar. Yes. We have a clamp. Yes. We have a headset. Yes. We have a deck. Yes. We have a fork. Yes. We have wheels. Yes. And we have grip tape. Yes. Is that a full scooter? Yes. It is a full scooter. So, you've watched enough custom builds. Yeah. What would you say right now? We're gonna get all our parts and <laughs> go to the studio. Alrighty, so we are back, we're in the studio. Ben got all the parts laid out in front of us and it's time for him to go over them one more time just in case you guys didn't pick up any of those parts in the uh, warehouse. So, you confident you know the names of all these parts? Yes. Are you really? Yes. 100%. Yes. Yes. All right, well, it's all you, let's hear it. All right, so we have the Ethic Panamonium deck we have the Devon Pelfrey Signature Affinity Bars. We have the Ethic Basic Clamp. <laughs> this is the Vault Velocity 2 headset. This is the Ethic Legion fork. These are the Native Emblem grips. Finally, we have the Envy Galaxy Pillar Grip Tape. Hey, that wasn't too shabby. Sweet, well, Sweet. now that they know all the parts we're using, yeah. it's time to actually build the scooter. Okay. Do you know how to build a scooter, Ben? No. <laughs> well, you came to the right place. So, normally, we start with gripping the deck. So let's mm -hmm. move everything out of the way, except for the deck and the grip tape, and we'll start doing that. All right. So, we only need <laughs> one tool. Yeah. Yeah, that's left. You got it, so keep going. Okay, we got it. <laughs> okay. So there's that part. And we pull the axle out, and we also are going to go ahead and take our spacers out. So, all right, now they're coming out. So Ben, what got you into scootering? Well, basically, this is the story of how I started scootering. So I used to be at this school called Geneva, and I was five years old, and I was about to have my sixth birthday. Mm -hmm. And that's when I started like actually like biking. I was like race biking. It was like. <laughs> yeah. And so basically none of these guys, like they're on training wheels still. And I wanted to do Nerf guns to like make it like a little bit more like cooler for them too. Yeah. It was just always raining and raining and raining. <laughs> mm -hmm. And so we couldn't have the birthday party. And so uh, we got a scooter. And that's how it all started? Yes. And look at you now, sponsored at eight years old. I'm just saying, it's crazy. All right, those are out. We gotta take off the brake. So you're gonna take this guy, and you're gonna loosen that. Ah, you got which it? Which way do we go? So let me make sure it's in there because we, we don't wanna strip anything. All right, so lefty loosey, righty tighty. Oh, it's coming off. Yeah. It's coming. It's coming. It might no actually more. be able to come out with your, uh, you might be able to twist it with your fan. Oh, it actually is out. There we go. And this is just a, uh, a tip. Mm -hmm. Whenever you take any bolt out, yes. if you're taking your brake off, yes. make sure to just get your bolt and screw it back in so then you never lose uh... anything. So you can see with the axle, I put the spacers back together with the oh, axle. Oh, yeah. So then I don't lose any of this when I need it later. Okay, so now then we can grip the deck. So we're just gonna put this guy right there. And we should be good. So here, go ahead and peel the, the back off of this.
Perfect. I've never seen this before. Hey, wait, it's a quarter pipe. Exactly. And I'm gonna go ahead and cut this. Cut that off. So, no, you can see it's still gonna be there. Oh, okay. There's no way I can cut that. <laughs> yeah, well, good thing is I'm cutting it because I'm sorry, I can't trust you with the razor blade. I can't trust myself with the razor blade, too. That's good. All right. You ready? This is the most satisfying part. Oh, that is so smooth. Dang, boy. That is so... That is really sharp. Right. It, it just literally, like, just... And it was already down, like, the grip. I think the grip tape is my favorite part of a custom build. What's your favorite part? I'd say probably grips, just putting on grips. They look really easy. I've never done it before, but I'd say that grip tape is like the second. Well, I'm gonna tell you right now, if you think putting on grips is easy, mm -hmm. you're in for a rude awakening because nobody can put on their grips that haven't done it before. What? Already the grip tape with like the deck just looks just complete fire. That's what I'm saying, right? It's, it's yeah. definitely gonna like be Thor. It's gonna look yeah. really Thory. Thory? Is Thor that even a word? Thory. I think so. <laughs> it sounds like you're saying story, but you have a lisp. Now, Kith. We're almost done. Don't worry, Ben. Were you sad when Iron Man died? Yeah. Did you cry? Yes. You cried too. What about when Spider-Man died, but then came back? Spider-Man died? In Infinity War. Remember when they were fighting Thanos on Titan and he died? He was all like, Mr. Stark, and then he like ashed away and it was super sad. Oh, yeah. I feel like this is like, we have to see the secret. Oh, it's the head too. Oh. oh. All right, so, Ben. What? I think the grip tape is done. Oh, yes! No way. All right, show them the, the final product. Now that the grip tape is on, what's next? The fork. Good guess. So, go ahead and grab the headset and the fork, Ben. And I'm gonna need you to loosen that guy out. Oh, this is gonna take a million years. It's almost there. Iron Man's dead. Why would you remind me? <laughs> he was my favorite Avenger. Who was my s also second favorite Avenger? We need to grease our headset bearings. So, to avoid making a huge mess, I will grease the bangs, but you need to push them in the deck, okay? Okay. Push this guy right there in the deck. Is that it? Yep. Ah! Perfect. Yep, and now you're gonna push it through the deck. Okay. Uh, like this? Mm-hmm, you got it from the bottom of the fork. Yeah. And <laughs> no, I don't wanna get any grease okay. on my hands. Is that it? Mm-hmm. Now you take the lovely dust cover and slide that guy down as well. I never knew that a dust cover could be in the metal. I always thought it was like... <laughs> Come on, where are those big muscles? Yeah. Uh, it's... It's okay. The gap is perfectly fine. Oh, cool. So now we have our HIC shim here. And then this is where this comes in play? Yes, but need some grease. 
Perfect. So now... Isn't it Andy who is like just the Grease King? That is Andy. But unfortunately, Andy doesn't work here anymore. All right. Is... He, he, he's going to school. R.I.P. Andy. <laughs> How do you put You just gotta twist you gotta yeah, just twist it. I'll hold the fork. Look at that. Teamwork, right? Oh. Alright. We're good? I think. Yup. Spins. Beautiful. I, it spins like heaven. I was gonna I was gonna say butter. So, that's installed. Let's put our wheel on. We can put our front wheel on. Alright, grab your wheel. Oh, this fork doesn't fit 120s either. No! We have to start over! No, worst comes to worst, we just have these different wheels. Okay. Apparently the Ethic Legion fork it didn't fit, so we have these root wheels. So, like Ben just said, we switched out the wheels for these Honeycore wheels. Honestly, black and gold, they look super good, and they resemble Thor's um, chest piece, or the buttons, or whatever you would call it, on his outfit perfectly. So, yeah, the for the sake of it, we're gonna switch to these. Back to where we were, time to install this front wheel. Perfect. Just gotta align it. What's happening? Ben, it's not going. Okay, so now use this to straighten out the bearing spacer. Boom. Yes! Teamwork. Wait a minute, does it, does it go this way? Mm-hmm. Okay, that's what I thought. Perfect, all right, so now, put it up here, and I'll hold it's this side. It's still loose. <laughs> no, I'll hold this side, and you tighten it right here. Okay. In. It's all good? Cool, it is tight. Hear that? Yeah. It's dialed? Yep. Perfect. All right, well, so now that we know the wheels will fit, we can put our brake back on at least. Ethic brakes can be a pain, so I'm gonna put this guy on for you and let you tighten it. Bro, uh, once this is done, this is gonna be sick. You think so? Yeah. Okay, tighten up the brake. I think so too. You just gotta over tighten it, you gotta strip it. No, you do not <laughs> wanna do that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Front wheel is on, Ben. Now it is time to do the back wheel. Our axle, and put our spacers back in. How do you like just, just do that? Like I said, dude, I built a lot of scooters in my, in my time. You ready to put the wheel on? Yeah. Does that fit? Mm-hmm, push it through. You had all this talk about your muscles, Ben, I'm telling you. Come on. <laughs> That's okay, you wanna use the hammer? Boom. All right. No. It's okay. It needs to be up a little bit. Oh my God, it was right there, bro. Cool. Want to use the hammer? Yeah. Go for it. Harder. Oh my gosh. You got to put some force into it. So you want to hit it right on the top. Like that? Mm-hmm. Nope. Hang on. Let me just have a word with this sec. Go for it. <laughs> yup. <Yeah. laughs> Alright, and now we just put a little bit of grease on this part because this is where it actually screws in. And then we're just gonna go like that. And now it is your turn. Technically it's a bolt, so Andy's gonna be mad. No, it's okay, we're still greasing it. You only need to grease that end though. So then we're gonna take your Allen wrench and it, tighten it up. Strip it. <laughs> it's okay. You don't need to do too much. Look at that. Spin that wheel. Look at that. Dude, this thing looks pretty cool, right? Yeah. What are you thinking? That's mm. dialed. So far. Well, it is time to put our grips on. The moment of truth, Ben. Feeble. It looks easy, but now you've... <laughs> <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> okay, so Ben, essentially what you do, right, is you take the tip of the nozzle mm -hmm. and you put it underneath the grip, so it's like that. And then you just... And then you, you push the air like that, and as you're doing that, you pull. 
That's all you do. You got it. <laughs> Come on, Ben. You said it was easy. Let's do it. I got really sweaty hands right now. <laughs> oh my gosh! You said it was easy. What happened? <laughs> it's not easy. Where'd that energy go, Ben? I don't know. Use your muscles. I don't oh. know at this point. <laughs> <laughs> All I can say is that I got sweaty hands. All right. Well. And if you know me, I have really sweaty hands. Putting on your grips is not as easy as I thought. There you go. Good job. All right. I will help you. Just feel how sweaty. Get your sweaty hands off me. <laughs> And just like that, Ben, the grips are installed. Don't you dare spray me with air. <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh, no. That's what I thought. Let's finish this build. Okay. So now you're going to slide the bars into the clamp. <laughs> Come on. Ben. It's like a hammer. All right. Oh, yeah, that's good. Boom. So make sure the clamp is nice and straight. Can you just hold it like that? Like, let, me, let me see. Hold it. To be honest with you, Ben, it's really not that crooked. Here, you put your Allen wrench in the clamp like that, mm -hmm. and then you can just pull it left or right. Mm -hmm. So how does that look? Tell me if that looks straight. That looks straight. Looks good? Okay, Ben, so finally, we're here at the end of the road. All we have to do is put the bar and on the And then tighten the compression. Well, all we have to do is put the bar on the scooter and tighten it up. You ready? Yeah. The compression's tight. I lied. We still have to put our bar ends in. All right, here you go. Hammer that guy in without hitting me. I believe in you, Ben. <laughs> yeah. You've been Let really cool. Let's move this. It's been really nice hanging out with you, so please don't hit me. Nice. Again. Yup. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yup. Yeah. We're doing it. Okay, go for it. It's okay, you got yeah. it. Do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good job. All right, Ben. Now we are at the end. The grand finale. Do you think you could slide Maybe. the bars on? Maybe. All right, here you go. Moment of truth. Yup. It's getting in. Wait, why is there smoke? It's just metal. Yes! Now he's going to put it on. Look! There was smoke. It's because this is one hot scooter. But, um, psh. <laughs> All right, Ben. Well, the bars are on. Let's make sure they're cut. Yeah, that's straight. Okay. All you have to do, Ben, is uh, tighten the clamp up. Oh, that one. <laughs> this way. Wait, but... There you okay. go. So now all you have to do is tighten it up. Yes, that is tight. <laughs> what? Good journey. All right, we're done. Woo! Alrighty, Ben. The scooter is complete. Yes. How do you feel about it? I feel so stoked about it. Do you think we accomplished the Thor look? Yes. Is it very Thory? Yes. What would you say is your favorite part of the scooter? I'd say it's honestly like just the the clamp and the bars because the gold with the red just goes like. Mm. Mm-hmm. And what was your favorite part about building the scooter? Um, I'd say the, the grips, I'm just joking. No, the grip tape. That's your favorite part? Yeah. You find it super satisfying? Yes. Heck yeah. Well, Ben, you did a great job. 
The scooter looks great. Let's throw that image of Thor up on the screen right around here so they can see the scooter compared to the, uh, the outfit. I think we did a really good job. Well, Ben, this is the end of the video, man. You did a great job for an eight-year-old. Honestly, <laughs> I think you did a better custom build than a lot of the other people that have come up. So, good job. And uh, what do you want to say to the people watching? So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please, please, please hit that like button. And also, subscribe. <laughs> you really should. If you guys haven't subscribed, you really should. We pump out some pretty cool scooter content, if I don't say so myself. Wait, um, can you follow me on my Instagram? It's at BigAirBen67. Right here, BigAirBen67. I'm telling you, you guys need to follow him. It's crazy. And like the man said, this is the end of the video, so make sure you guys hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. If you guys are a fan of Big Air Ben, all of his social links will be down below. And if you guys want to see more of him on the channel, just let us know because he's part of the family now. Before you guys go, hit subscribe, turn those notification bells on so you never miss an upload here on the Vol Pro Scooters channel. And shop thevolproscooters.com for all your scooter needs. Yes. Right, Ben? Yes. Boom. All right, guys. Until the next video, have a good one, and we'll see you then.